برنا لك نزوا ما تلت فيو أهلا وسهلا فيكم بفيديو جديد. This video we're gonna be talking about five expressions that you should not believe when you hear them from a Lebanese person. The first one in this video is خمسة أي وبكون عندك five minutes and I'll be at your place. When a Lebanese person says in five minutes he's gonna be there, that means he's still in bed. He hasn't even brushed his teeth. It's gonna take at least half an hour until he calls you and then tells you oh, by the way in five minutes I will be there like that's like an extra five minutes for you to handle but this five minutes also means half an hour that means all in all it's gonna take I don't know, one hour one and a half two if he starts blaming the the traffic ah oh, man I just said the the traffic ex excuse in Lebanon is like the best excuse you, you can have because you can always blame it on the traffic because we always have traffic like what? Go out, get out of the house one hour earlier? Pfft. Get the f out of here, man. Number two. Inti awal binti bhayate. Shu kif. You're the first girl in my life. Dude, is a يعني is a habit to tapa alaykum. Inti awal binti bhayate. I can't help you. When a guy tells you you're the first woman in my life, do not believe him. At least, at least he had a theoretical relationship with like three or four women, and that's just in his mind. So if a guy tells you you're the first girl in my life, just tell him. Say wallah. Hello. P.S. I'm offering this book for free if you want to get it. The link in the description and also in the comment section down below. It's a spoken Arabic book. If you are interested in it, you can get it over here. Back to the video. Number three is when you call someone, that guy picks up and says, He will say that if you want money from him. It's like, you. I just wanted to call you, man. I just wanted to. Yeah, I don't think so because you owe me 200 bucks. That's why I waited three days because I wanted to just be polite and then I called you. And now you tell me, oh, I, I just wanted to get the F out of here, man. And then he tells you he has no money and then the exchange rate to dollars are 5,000. That typical Lebanese excuses, you know. But yeah, but yeah I mean, he is like, 5,000 technically. Number four, it's kind of a, the same thing, like, you know. Can Jade Alak Brajala Kya on Echir Shahar? It's like I'm I'm gonna pay you back at the end of the month. You're not gonna pay me back at the end of the month. I know that. It's like ah wallah tala alayhi ishtarak al ah an kasar sat la mayu but the jibla hada. Ah ma is uh ah an kasar shatafi and the but the you know mission no heck. Dude you're not gonna pay me back ever. Like I know, khalas. It's too late to apologize. That's like even if he picks up, because if somebody owes you money and then you call him up be like, it's not gonna pick up. And the excuse for that is, man, I can't have connection. WhatsApp, I can't be that. It's always something. I can't have the unit that. I'm the one who's calling you, man. The last one for today is, I'm be akia brismela. I'm selling you it, and I'm getting no capital gains whatsoever from it. No profit. I'm selling you a T-shirt with no profit. Aya satle be asadi ashi. Yani sorry, but I have to say it. Who runs a store selling stuff with no profit? And even like to to spice it up, like if he, if he says like yo, I'm be I'm be akia habrismela. You know, it, like he will hit the jackpot if there's something religious going on. If he's a Muslim, he'll be like, Wahiyat al adana bi akhir But he will play on the sentence a bit so that he doesn't go to hell. So, Wahiyat al adam or something like that, you know. So he will say like a word like that, that was with the end, that was not with the end, you know, and uh, you know. Like he even like swears on the adhan that he's selling it with no profit. And if it's a question, I, be, I think he will go like, Wahiyat al I don't know. But they will think of something to just get out of it and we just sting it with something religious. But then we don't like it when Mr. Alayla do a concert. The bonus one for today when a person tells you لازم نعملها قريبا لازم نعملها قريبا like we're gonna do it soon that means you're gonna do it probably in three years. لازم لازم نظهر لازم نظهر قريبا The last time we went out it was like five years ago. We're not gonna do it soon. And then the other person, when he's like also like not in the mood to go out, like inshallah. That's like the top when you want to top it up. Then when you're saying, hey, we have to do it soon, and then you say inshallah. Just like both of them are just like lying to each other. You just took it to the next Lebanese level. It's ah, oh, inshallah. The typical Arabic no. Damn son. Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you like it, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Please hit the like button. It really helps with the channel. If you are interested in learning or getting or starting your journey in learning the Lebanese Arabic, it's over here. The link again in the description and also in the comment section down below. And I will see you guys later.
ఇప్పుడు నెల